From now on, if you're heading out to get some groceries or perhaps pick up a takeaway for your evening meal, you're gonna have to get used to wearing one of these because face coverings have become mandatory in enclosed public spaces in England. Beforehand, it's been compulsory to wear face coverings on public transport, but now we all have to wear face coverings when we go to the shops. And that means including indoor shopping centres, when you are in transport hubs. So before it was just when you got on the train, whereas now it will be in the station as well. Um, so also even when you go to a takeaway, for example, to pick up takeaway food, so generally speaking, it's going to be a good idea to have a mask with you. And of course, that, that rule covers uh, face coverings. You know, it's not just the likes of mask, anything that, that covers your, your mouth and your nose. Um, what other things might people find around the home that they might be able to use? Absolutely. You can use scarves. You can use a bandana just sort of tied around the face. You can just have a scarf coming up. It has to cover your nose, your mouth and your chin. And it helps if it's sort of nice and tight over the front. There is advice on the government website, gov.uk, how you can make a face covering from an old t-shirt or a piece of cloth. You don't need to be able to sew. Now the Welsh Government are yet to make an official announcement on the use of mandatory face coverings in enclosed public spaces. But either way, the science suggests these things save lives. It's not been the norm for us in the UK. It's not been a normal part of our culture, like it is in some countries in Asia, for example. But we know this is another way to reduce the spread of coronavirus, along with hand washing and social distancing. And if we all get on board with that, it would be great.